So it says, how do I evaluate pi over sine pi over three without using a calculator? How do I evaluate sine pi over three without a calculator? I'll just say I'll just say that because I'm not going to use a calculator for this. So how would I do that? So again, we're looking at this is a grade eleven uh, classic question in trigonometry where we're talking about uh, in terms of radians. When we're talking about trigonometry in terms of radians. So what we're going to have to do is we are going to have to uh, kind of convert all these guys into uh, degrees because that's what we're kind of uh, we're kind of familiar with, right? So let's do that. So uh, so let's let's convert this into degrees. So let's convert this into something that we know. So again, uh, when we talk about sine pi over three, pi here equals one hundred eighty, right? So we're talking about this is sine pi, which equals one hundred and eighty degrees. So wait, let me let me just write this down. So if pi equals 100 degree, 180 degrees, then sine uh, pi over 3 equals sine, this is 180 degrees oh, divided by 3 here, which equals sine 60, right? Sine 60. Okay, so if we have sine 60, then what we have is, we, we're, we this is testing us the knowledge of our special triangles, right? So for example, if we had something like this, where... Um, uh, let's see. We have something like, uh, if you remember from our special triangles, what this what this would give us would be we would have to draw a triangle that looks something like this. And I'll show you here. We have to draw a right triangle, and this angle here is a sixty degree angle. This here is a thirty degree angle. And what that would give us in terms of lengths would this be? Would this one would be a one? This here is a two, and this here is a root three, right? So that is my special triangle. Remember, this here is a special triangle. We have to learn. Uh, we, we have to learn two special triangles in grade eleven or in algebra one. Um, we have the other one here, which is uh, simply forty-five degrees here and forty-five degrees here, right? And this is a one, one, and root two kind of triangle here. So these two are special triangles. These are very, very important. So I'm going to start with them. These are very, very important ones to know because you're going to have to find the exact value of a lot of these guys here. Okay, so uh, in doing that, where you're going to use the first special triangle, right? Because I have 60 degrees. This here is the only ang uh, only triangle with 60 degrees. I'm finding the sine of that, right? Sine 60. What's sine 60 here? This is the opposite over the hypotenuse. So the opposite here is root 3. Let me do this in blue. So sine 60 would equal the opposite, opposite over hypotenuse, right? Which is here. The opposite of 60 degrees here is uh, the root 3. And then the hypotenuse here is 2, right? This here is the hypotenuse, which is 2. Therefore, sine, and I can convert this back to radians, sine pi over 3 equals root 3 over 2. So this here is my exact value of sine pi over 3. So let's see how they did here. Uh, let's see what they did uh, with this uh, here. So it says, how do you calculate sine pi over 3? Sine pi over 3. Uh, okay, sine pi over 3 goes 180 divided by 3. That's good. Sine 180 degrees divided by is sine 135. This here is uh, This here is incorrect here. Sine 180 divided by 3 here is sine 60, not 135. So this, they actually did the question wrong here. This step is wrong. And then when you have sine 60 equals sine uh, 90 minus 30, okay? They're using an identity to help solve for sine 135 in this case. Uh, so this here is actually a wrong solution um, because of this step here. Sine 135 does not equal this. Uh, solution is incorrect because of this statement. I'm going to say here, so sine 180 divided by 3 equals sine 60, not sine 135. Therefore, the correct, correct solution is uh, sine pi over 3 equals, this would be pi, uh, root 3, so square root of 3, square root of 3 over 2. So I hear it, and therefore that's the correct solution. So again, this solution here is incorrect.